Stop. What's going on here? There's no soliciting, no panhandling allowed in this area. I've told you that before many times. I've never heard that before. You must have me mistaken for somebody else. I'm sure you get a lot of money that way, faking a serious injury. I'm not faking anything. Give me those. Hey, wait. I said give them to me. What are you doing? I'm, hey, I need those to walk, man. Hey, stop it. No, don't break them. Stop! What's going on here? Nothing is going on. Didn't you hear me ordering you to stop? Officer, I did nothing wrong. Oh yes you have. There's no soliciting, no panhandling allowed in this area. I've told you that before many times. What? I've never heard that before. You must have me mistaken for somebody else. It was you. Don't get smart. Officer, as you can see, I'm injured. I can't walk, I can't work. Not my problem. This intersection is the only way that I can make some money so I can get me something to eat. Look, rules are rules. I don't ever want to see you begging for change at this intersection again, understand? Come on, officer, please. Can you just give me a break? Can you just like look the other way or pretend that I'm not even there? <laughs> Excuse me? You want me to look the other way when someone is committing a crime? Did you just say that to me? No, no, I didn't mean it like that, I just... You're lucky I don't arrest you right now. If it weren't the end of my shift, I would take you in right now. You're gonna arrest me? I would, but you would stink up my car. Ever hear a soap? Come on, officer, you don't have to be like that. I am a human being, you know? You're a bum. You expect a handout. You want everything to be given to you for free? Are these crutches part of the game? Excuse me? You get some crutches, tape up your leg, and pretend to be hurt. I'm sure you get a lot of money that way, faking a serious injury. I'm not faking anything. I did injure myself in an accident, and I really hurt my leg. Sure you did. I saw you with those bandages last week. You're not fooling me, pal. Before today, officer, I've never seen you before a day in my life. You've got things twisted. Give me those. Hey, wait. I said give them to me. What are you doing? I. Hey, I need those to walk, man. Hey, stop it. No, don't break them. Wait, no. What are you doing? Oh, sorry about that. Here you go. I can't believe this, man. Now get out of here. This officer. Come on, guy, what, what's going on here? Get out of here. Hello, come on. Oh, come on. Oh. Uh, okay. Officer Clark. Oh, hello, Captain. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. What seems to be the problem here? Uh, no problem. I have everything under control. What? It doesn't look like you have everything under control. Why don't you tell me what's going on? Let's start from the beginning. 
I confronted this man at the intersection back there. He was panhandling, sir, which is illegal in this area. Furthermore, he has repeatedly violated my orders. I've told him several times, there's no panhandling allowed in this area. What? That's not true. I never met this man a day in my life. Shut up! He's not talking to you! Hey, hey, guys, 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 hold on. Sir, I promise you, I will get to your side of the story. Continue, officer. Not only was he breaking the law, Captain, but his whole shtick here is just an act. He's, you know, faking this so-called injury in order to get money out of people. He's a lousy bum who belongs behind bars. So, is that why you were kicking him? What? Yeah, I saw that with my own eyes. He disobeyed my orders. So that gives you the right to kick him like he's some type of dog? Sir, I'm Captain James Porter of the Mango Park Police Department. On behalf of my department, please, I would like to extend my apologies for the behavior of this officer. But Captain, you don't understand. I'm not talking to you, Clark. And don't get it twisted, because I totally understand perfectly I'm curious, what happened to your leg? Well, I was painting a house, and I fell off of a ladder and took a real nasty fall. Mm, I'm sorry to hear that, but where's your other crutch? Magnum P.I. over here took it, and he broke it. Is that right? I acted in self-defense. He attacked me. Wait, no, I didn't. He's lying. I'm telling you, Captain. This guy's a menace. Arrest him. No, no, I'm not. I'm innocent. <sighs> well, I believe you. Ha! <laughs> You're in trouble now, Buster. I wasn't talking to you. I was talking to him. I believe him. You ought to be ashamed of your actions today. You're lucky I don't suspend you. But Captain, you don't understand. Sus suspend me for what? I was making our streets safer. You were harassing and making a false allegation against this young man, and you owe him an apology. What? No way. Officer Clark, you will apologize. Not only that, you're gonna buy him a new set of crutches, or else. Or else what? Officer Clark, I'm not asking again. Apologize. Never gonna happen. Turn around. What? You are hereby suspended for the next 60 days. You're suspending me? Is this a joke? No, this is not a joke. And you're gonna be donating your salary for the next two months to this young man. By the way, what's your name? Kendrick, Kendrick Reginald Johnson Jr. Kendrick Reginald Johnson. Junior. Junior, of course. Well, Mr. Junior, you're gonna be receiving a check in your name on behalf of Officer Clark right here. Oh, well, that's mighty kind of you, sir. Thank you very much. And thank you too, officer. This is insane. You can't do this to me. Oh, yes I can. And it's already done. And you have nobody to blame but yourself. What's going on here? Why, why are you arresting me? Arresting you? I'm not arresting you. I'm suspending you. But I do want you to know what it feels like to be humiliated out in public. So come on, let's go. Kendrick, now you make sure you come by the station tomorrow and you're gonna have a check waiting for you, I promise. Thank you, officer, I will do that. I could do a lot of things with that money. You don't even have no idea. Thank you so much. Well, let's hope that that money is used for the better, huh? That's right, sir. Thanks a lot, sir. Thank you so much. You have a good day. You too. Thank you so much. Thank you. 